Staying in Washington County, former Ecclesia College President Oren Paris III involved in a kickback scheme is back in court today. KWA's Kelly O'Neill is in studio, and Kelly, he's hoping to get all his charges dismissed. Crystal, that's right. Back in 2018, Paris was sentenced to three years in prison for fraud charges involving a kickback scheme that diverted funds to Ecclesia College from the state's General Improvement Fund. His co-conspirators, former state Senator John Woods and consultant Randall Shelton, were also convicted and are serving time in federal prison. Paris was back in court today after a conditional guilty plea let him appeal to the Eighth Circuit Court out of St. Louis. Now, his attorney, Travis Story in Fayetteville, argued before three judges at the Eighth Circuit this morning, claiming evidence in Paris's favor was destroyed. Today we argued that because of the FBI agent intentionally deleting and destroying the contents of the laptop, because he did that in bad faith and destroyed evidence that was potentially useful to Dr. Paris's defense, that that should in and of itself result in dismissal of the indictment against Dr. Paris. The result of which would mean that his conditional plea is unwound and that Dr. Paris would not have a, a felony record, would not have any charges left against him. Paris pleaded guilty to one count of conspiracy in federal court in April of 2018, paying kickbacks to Woods and State Representative Mike Neal in exchange for grants to Ecclesia College from 2013 to 2015. According to the U.S. Justice Department, the grants totaled over $700,000, 500000 of which came from Woods and Neal. A story says the Eighth Circuit Court will issue a written decision about the appeal within 90 days. In studio, Kelly O'Neill, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News. All right, thank you.